Hello, it's Daniel here. Um, just a user computer here on the network. Uh, what I've noticed is that uh, ESET Nod32 uh, antivirus is stuck on a product update. Okay, so um, this is for people who are stuck on this update. Uh, you can see here that uh, ESET Nod32 antivirus 7 in this area here um, will change when you're updated to the new version and this is 7.0.302.26 okay when you when you click on check for updates it tells you that it's up to date it seems it's actually stuck on this version because there is a newer one um, what I'm going to do here is provide um, provide to you newer version okay um, I'm just going to dump this over the network here it's nice that it doesn't work So this is how you fix it, and I'm going to provide links there uh, for you in the description of the video so that you can download this. This is going to um, this is going to allow you to update on to the next version. So hopefully that the, the product update where it appears to be stuck has been fixed. Uh, I'll just, so you're going to double click on it as I just did, and just extract the folder to a destination desktop is the easiest and you're going to double click on the EI underscore 5d2.msi file okay this is going to start the um, well the installation wizard for mod 32 click next accept next yeah you can certainly be a part of the grid So this is going to update the software to the next version. Keep in mind that you will need a system restart, or should do a system restart after uh, this version is patched. ignore those warnings because it's going to remove the old version before it installs a new one. Now normally I would just uh, probably like end the video here or something like that and provide you with the link. However, people may be sensitive that this is not a standardized installation from ESET. You can download the ESET Live Updater if you want from their website. I guarantee you this will be faster. The reason this is faster is this is the same data that the live update will download before it installs. So if you just download this directly, uh, this will be the data outright. You can just install it directly. And you'll be able to see that this is, you know, a normal piece of software here in a moment. You might notice that this is already updated to a slightly cleaner, nicer version. 
that's what you're going to need to restart. When you go to the update, you'll be able to see here that the product update that's installed now is 7.0.317.4 instead of 302.26. Hopefully this version has a the major product update repair in it. Um, if it does not, uh, you will need to patch it again, maybe in the future um, when it's repaired. So as mentioned, you're going to restart the computer. Once it's restarted, then it should be uh, properly operating. Thank you very much. Ciao.